touching it and seeing it in action is really exciting. I really, I really believe in this machine to help in certain uh, cases. They say it will revolutionize pet health care in Canada. Now the Regional Animal Protection Society in Richmond has become the first veterinary facility in the country to use a hyperbaric chamber for pets. We put a patient in here and then we uh, put oxygen 100% in there and then increase the pressure. That way the, the uh, dissolvable oxygen in the blood rises and then we can supply the organs and the tissue with more oxygen and that helps healing. The technology has been used with humans for years to treat carbon monoxide poisoning or help divers suffering from the bends. Vets here believe it can dramatically help pets with healing after surgery, anti-inflammation and a variety of other ailments. Since installation, over 20 different types of pets have used the hyperbaric machine. Rookie Roo here is an old pro. And the amazing thing is, none of them have had to have any sedation. They feel really comfortable in there. I think it's quiet, it's relaxed, and, and they're relaxed. And most, the, so far, the, the, the pets that we did, dogs and cats from our shelter, did great in there. I was surprised too. Similar chambers are widely used in the U.S. The Richmond vets are now hoping to team up with UBC academics to study the benefits on patients. So I look at this as a win-win situation. The side effects in, from this chamber are, are not common. It's a very safe uh, dive, what we call it. So either it's going to help or it's not going to help. Each session costs around $280. Already one PC pet insurer has said it'll add the treatment to their benefits. And four-legged patients here can't wait to climb in. We definitely have bookings and we have a waiting list right now as we start getting geared up and we're going to be adding more and more days of uh, treatments to the calendar. The hyperbaric chamber will be open to the public on the 22nd of February. Each session here will last only 45 minutes. That's if you can get Rookie Roo out. In Richmond, Tom Walsh, City News.